Meet tennis star Frances Tiafo's girlfriend. Yes, she's black. Hey everyone, welcome back to this channel. Subscribe this channel for latest trending stories every day. Let's start the video. Ayan Broomfield, the girlfriend of tennis player Frances Tiafo, probably caught her response after he pulled off an incredible comeback victory against Ben Shelton in the third round of the 2024 US Open, if you watched or followed along. In case you missed the live broadcast, online videos of Broomfield displaying her emotional roller coaster and tears in her eyes while she watched her partner play have been circulated. Her fans are curious to learn more about her now that she's gone viral. When did Tiafo and Broomfield start dating? Although Tiafo and Broomfield haven't talked about their exact dating history, we do know that they started dating in 2015, since on September 8, 2019, Tiafo celebrated their fourth anniversary. Hey guys, happy fourth year anniversary. The time flew by so quickly. We've been hanging out together, he wrote on Instagram. I adore you, sweetie. I couldn't imagine being with anybody else, but you're one wild girl. He also made reference to the year in a another post, saying, Man, to think how far we've come. 2015 was the year I first met you and also the year I started my profession. You've been my rock through it all, the positive, negative, and stagnant aspects. It has been an experience beyond description. The couple has been dating since 2015, but they didn't make their relationship official on Instagram until 2018. On August 13, 1997, Broomfield was born in Ontario, Canada. She played tennis for two years at Clemson University after immigrating to the United States. She won the ITA Carolina Region Rookie of the Year Award and the ACC Freshman of the Year Award in her first two seasons with the Tigers. She transferred to UCLA in 2017. She was in a partnership with Gabby Andrews while she played for the Bruins. They defeated Michigan Wolverines Kate Fahey and Brienne Miner in the doubles match of the 2019 NCAA Division I Women's Tennis Championship. Professional tennis player Broomfield also had a short documentary on her life debut on Amazon Prime in 2019. Additionally, she served as a body double for actor Sonia Sidney, who played Venus Williams in the biographical movie King Richard, which came out in 2021. She now works as a social media influencer and content producer. She also recently launched a charitable foundation. Elevate local programs worldwide, highlighting their impactful activities and increasing visibility, and provide those in need with athletic gear to enrich their lives through the power of sport, are the two main goals of the Ian Broomfield Foundation. One of Tiafo's greatest supporters, Broomfield enjoys celebrating his accomplishments in public. When he rose to the top of the world rankings in 2023, she posted on Instagram with the caption, Top 10 in the world. A few years ago, I began to take screenshots of various achievements and moments in anticipation of this day. I believe this tells the narrative rather well, but I can't post them all. I'm very happy for you. Significant accomplishment, and I believe we can now declare that big foe came up. And then there was her response when she was halfway out of her seat, watching her lover play during his match versus Shelton, which redefined what it meant to be on the edge of your seat. On August 13, 1997, Broomfield was born in Ontario, Canada. Before coming to the United States to pursue her tennis career at Clemson University in South Carolina, she lived in Canada during her early years. Broomfield spent two years as a tennis player at Clemson University. She was recognized as the ITA Carolina Region Rookie of the Year and the ACC Freshman of the Year during that time. According to her bio, Broomfield chose to transfer to UCLA after her sophomore year at Clemson because of its rich history and to have the opportunity to create something for its future and she did. Broomfield made her WTA debut in 2014 at the Coupe Banque Nationale, where she participated in the doubles division with her partner, Maria Petrascu, prior to attending college. The rookie team, ranked 467 in the world, had a stellar year. Broomfield then made the decision to dedicate all of her time and resources to her solo career. Broomfield is a well-known player in women's tennis who has alliances with Wilson and Athleta, the couple hasn't disclosed many specifics about how they initially met, even though they have been together for almost 10 years. But as per Tiafo's Instagram, September 8, 2015, is their anniversary. In honor of their fourth anniversary, Tiafo wrote a heartfelt ode to Broomfield and included a picture of the couple looking put together for a night on the town. 
sweet social media tributes to one another are not uncommon from Broomfield and Tiafo. However, Broomfield didn't publicly admit their relationship until 2018 on Valentine's Day, when she posted a picture of herself and Tiafo. Broomfield is seen throwing her arms around Tiafo's shoulders in the adorable picture. Because of her remarkable tennis abilities, Broomfield has had thrilling encounters both on and off the court. She was given the chance to serve as Sonia Sidney's body double in King Richard, where she played Venus Williams. Broomfield got to know Serena Williams and Will Smith, who were portraying her character's parents, on set. In and out of the tennis court, Broomfield is Typho's biggest fan. Broomfield joins the crowd in supporting her longtime partner when their schedules allow it. She also enjoys extravagant expressions of love that are also surprises. Unbeknownst to Tiafo, Broomfield was in the company of Tiafo's family and friends in 2023 when he won the Fayez Sarafim and Company U.S. Men's Clay Court Championship, his second ATP title. Tiafo didn't realize his girlfriend was present to watch him perform in person until the end of the first set. He spoke candidly about the incident during his victory speech after the game. In August 2023, Broomfield talked candidly about her relationship with Typho and how their personalities complement each other in an ATP interview. Broomfield remarked, That was definitely a fun moment, in reference to her boyfriend's noteworthy victory over Rafael Nadal at the 2022 U.S. Open, which was included in Netflix's Breakpoint series. Naturally, you will be ecstatic to have defeated one of the greatest tennis players ever. However, Francis is the happiest person ever. Although Typho is inherently happy-go-lucky, Broomfield clarified that she usually takes things more seriously. I believe we greatly balance each other out, she continued. The former NCAA champion also discussed how Typho and herself might connect because of their common athletic background. We can discuss tennis. I mean, I used to play tennis. I may therefore occasionally serve as a sounding board for matches, even simply when we're watching the draw and we kind of look at specific players she remarked. Additionally, Typho values having someone to discuss strategy with even though he doesn't always heed her advice. I just feel like we just understand it and what it takes for someone to go and be able to compete at the highest level, Broomfield added. An endearing video of Boston Celtics coach Joe Mazzulla and his wife Kamai enjoying a special moment on the court after winning the 2024 NBA championship moved Francis Tiafo's girlfriend Ayan Broomfield. According to Broomfield, it was one of the most beautiful moments I've ever seen. In the NBA Finals, the Boston Celtics defeated the Dallas Mavericks 106-88 to win their first championship since 2008 and set a new record. Holding hands and strolling through the deserted arena, Mazzulla remained at TD Garden with his spouse into the wee hours of the morning, making history as the youngest coach to lead a club to a championship since Bill Russell in 1969. Several sports pages posted the video of their romantic stroll on social media. On June 21st, Broomfield shared a video of the Missoula's post-game festivities on her Instagram story. This struck me as one of the most exquisite scenes I've ever witnessed. After winning the title, Joe and Kamai Mazzula strolled around the court around 3 in the morning while holding hands. How lovely! Emoji of face containing tears, Broomfield wrote. Following a tumble in his Queen's Club Championship's first-round match, Tiafo recently sustained a hip injury. The Americans' preparations for the Wimbledon Championships may be jeopardized by this ailment. Ayan Broomfield, the girlfriend of Francis Tiafo, defended the 26-year-old when a reviewer questioned his form and said he wasn't playing his best tennis. The criticism followed Tiafo's dramatic comeback from a two-set deficit to upset Mattia Bellucci in his French Open first-round match. According to Essentially Sports, Tiafo and Broomfield initially got to know each other through their common acquaintance, fellow tennis star Vicky Duval. During the 2015 U.S. Open, Tiafo allegedly initiated contact by slipping into Broomfield's Instagram direct messages. Since 2006, when Andy Roddick, also 24, reached the finals of the U.S. Open, Tiafo, 24, is the youngest American man to advance this far in the tournament. 